Welcome to Vinebrook Homes. Our skilled service techs are happy to help you with any issue that you may have. However, if the issue is deemed to be your responsibility, that service call can come with a $75 price tag at minimum. So, here's a few things that you can check and maintain yourself to save a little cash. Today, we're going to take a look at relighting your pilot light. A pilot light is something that furnaces or water heaters maintain to jumpstart their heating process. If the light goes out, then cold air or water are sure to follow since they have lost the start to their heating process. Before we begin relighting, there are a few things to clear up. One, do you have a pilot light? Two, is it out? The pilot light is a small, usually blue flame on your water heater, furnace, or other appliance. Often, there are covers over a small sight glass which allows you to see the flame. If you see that your appliance has this and it is indeed out, then move on to the posted directions. To restart the pilot light, begin by referring to the instructions listed on the appliance. However, they should be similar to what you'll see in this video. Turn the gas regulator valve to the off position and wait five minutes for everything to clear. If you still smell gas after five minutes, then call a professional right away since there's likely a leak somewhere. Next, remove the covers over the burner door and sight glass. Make sure to mark your heat control knob so you can return it to this position once you've finished. Set the heat control and regulator to pilot and make sure your igniter is working properly by checking the sight glass for spark while pressing the igniter. Once all that is set, hold down the pilot switch at the regulator and spark the igniter switch until you have relit the small flame. Continue to hold the pilot switch down for one minute. After a minute, release the switch. If the flame goes out, there may be further problems to address. However, if this solved the problem, turn the regulator to on and return your heat control to its original position. If the pilot light did not stay on, make sure to contact maintenance to get that restored.